morning all. We are back at Hayes. Late August, August bank holiday. It's Sunday, so it's uh, day one of bank holidays. I'm not sure how this is gonna go. Looks quite busy. How much for that? Yeah, yeah, how much is it? Five pounds. Which one your VHS is back there? Hey. Oh, hey! Hey, dude, man. Oh, okay. I didn't know you were stalling that today. Yeah, just get rid of a few bits. Oh, shit. Oh, it's more, Ben's here as well, selling. Yeah. yeah. I don't know where he's, I don't know where he's, I'd literally I just go here, so. Somewhere. Just take him. Take him? Yeah. Do you want him? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, thanks, man. That's right. Sweet. Uh, how much are your wee rights? Um, so the whole wee is £20 for the lot with this. For the lot? Yeah. You won't do anything individually, no? No, I'd rather to get rid of it. Okay. Because I just want one, I just need one of these really. You, oh, you only need one of those? Yeah, it's like two quid I'll give you a few? Yeah, good. Yeah? Can you just put your chip in? That's got loads it. of corrosion. Have you got a, like a different one? Like, I just want to see a... Uh, are you fussy with what colour? No, no, no. Well, yeah, black if possible. I'll let you have a little look. Yeah, 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 perfect. There you go. Yeah, thank, you. thank you very much. Cheers. How much for that? Um, I'm doing that for two pound, the controllers. Does it work? Um, as far as I know. Have you got more controllers then? And there are five of those. Yeah, oh, the air force is sorry. Yeah, yeah. So I don't want to mess up your stuff in here. Yeah. I will take that though. Yeah. 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 Oh, my feet are soaked. Waiting for your thin grass. And my feet are. So I'll pretend it's someone else's stall. Oh my god, look at all this retro stuff. Oh my god, I can't believe it. <laughs> How much new games at the front here? Sorry? How much new games at the front? What, one yeah. Um, pound each. Pound each? Uh, do you want him for a fiver? Six for a fiver? Yeah, go on then. Yeah. You alright? Yes. 
much is those games? Uh, they are eight pounds each. That's like a two pound game to say, you know. Are they? That's a, that one is. That one's like a that's like a 12, 13 pound game, but that's super cheap. Just to let you know. Oh right, okay. Twenties. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can honestly, like with the scope, it's worth a bit more, but on its own, it's worth subtle. I really. Yeah. I'm the game's over here. Many more games, mate. Is that what you got? Is that what you got? Games wise, or I don't know. Oh, you don't know. I'll come back later. How much are they anyway? Those ones there. Two quid each. Too much. Too much. How much in your Funko pop back there? The what, so this one? Yeah. Fiver. Fiver. Oh, yeah. No, don't open it, please. It's just, it's just a two things. Why is money? There are. They're one off. They're one off. They're one off. They're one off. They're one There you go, mate. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Thank you very much. How much on your Wii games, mate? Five uh, pound each. How much are you games here? Um, so it's just the Star Wars one is two pounds, all the rest are fifty p. Okay, I'll take that. And we're back. So just come back from Hayes Boot Fair. Uh, today was actually really good. Uh, got some really cool stuff. Um, got some really good trading stuff as well for Computer Exchange. I mean, it was tricky today. Uh, there was a lot of people there when I got there. I mean, I got there like. Probably started hunting just before six o'clock. Um, Bargain Ben was there selling. Um, I know he didn't actually do as well as he has done previously. Um, he was asking, you know, some the pretty high prices on his games. He, he won't like me saying that, but um, you know, he did all right. And uh, yeah, I mean, like I kept going back to like certain stalls because I know they had like games, and like I got pretty successful doing that, like because. Um, you know like it's always good to go like if you're if you're there at a booth fair, you know you, and you, you're able to take your time it's good to go back to stalls sometimes just to see if they're getting anything else out there at their car because like they don't necessarily get everything out straight away and i managed to get one really like high valued game from doing that for a pound so like that was really good 
And uh, yeah, Scott saw uh, Scott's Comics and Collectible selling there today as well. And um, yeah, he sorted me out with the first thing I'm going to show you as well. So like, um, I would say big up for that, obviously. And um, well, when I show you, when I show you guys, like I say, thank you again, obviously. And uh, yeah, I mean, like, it was busy, but I think it probably could have been a little bit busier. I think that like the the weather it wasn't raining, but it was cloudy. It was really overcast, and like, oh my feet were so wet, like, because the the grass was so long, like, and all the condensation has been trapped in it. Oh, my feet got soaked. But I digress, and we'll get to the pickups. So, first thing I'm going to show you is what Scott uh, sorted me out with, which is all of these WCW versus NWO uh, VHS tapes. Um, and I, th I think they're all from like yeah early to mid 90s and you know what like these are so cool i mean i've got a vhs player just there to play it on as well and um i, I, lo I love getting these old vhs tapes for um wcw and wwe because wwf because they're uncut like if you watch these on the on the network like they're all like cut up and you know they you know it's all like kind of pc now all kind of pit politically, politically correct but this you know these are all these all came out at the time of their release you know at the time of their viewing so and you know thanks so much for sorting me that uh, sorting me out with these scott because yeah these are really cool man i really appreciate it so yeah i didn't pay for these these are free so yeah all those reissue tapes there so let's get on to the games so first pile is a bunch of wii games that i got from the same seller and all these were a fiver, so I'm just going to go through them all together. So they're all pretty much Lego games. We've got Pirates of the Cam Caribbean Lego. We've got uh, Back to the Future the game, which is, this is worth a bit of money. This is not too bad. Uh, we've got Lego Batman, DC Superheroes. We've got Ghostbusters, the video game. We have Lego Indiana Jones. And we have Harry Potter, C years of five to seven. Uh, some of the discs are in alright condition, some of them aren't, uh, but that's alright because I now know someone who has a disc cleaner and um, I will be taking it along to her at some stage. So if they are too scratched and they don't take them, then I can just take them. It's a cool thing to say, sort of So that's them. And then we've got uh, two 3DS games. So we've got uh, Lego Friends on the 3DS, this is a pound, um, it's complete. Again, I, I went a bit Lego crazy with the games today. Um, I mean, yeah, it was only a pound, and whenever I see a Lego game, whether it be for the 3DS or whether it be for the Wii or whatever, I, apart from PlayStation 2, because they didn't sell for very much, but I just pick it up, do you know what I mean? Because I just, I always assume that. And they had a few others as well, they had some other Wii games and some other 3DS games, but some of the cases were empty, some of them, you know, they just didn't look like they were worth that much, so I didn't get them. And then we've got Fantasy Life. Now, this is the one that was worth, I mean, it even says £22 from the computer exchange on the front. Um, it looks obviously very Japanese-y, I mean, I don't really know too much about it. Uh, it's complete, it's all in there. Uh, it chops in straight away as a voucher for £12, so, you know, it's a great profit on that already. Uh, then we've got two other games that I'm not sure if they're going to be worth anything at all. We've got Fortnite uh, Deep Freeze Bundle, which is only 50p. Um, I've never played Fortnite, don't know anything about it, thankfully. Uh, but yeah, I just bought it because I know like it's very popular. Do you know what I mean? So like, it's only 50p as well, so I picked it up. And then we got uh, Lego Dimensions and the Wii U. Now, obviously, Wii U is like becoming quite collectible already. Um, but I didn't realise that this is like part of a bundle, so like you kind of need the, like the Lego set with it to kind of get any money for it. Probably sell it as it is on eBay, but they can't chop it in a computer exchange like this because it has no barcode or anything. So but that's fine. I mean, I just put up and say this selection. That's not a problem. But yes, an yes, another Lego game. And then we've got two pads. We've got the black Wii Motion Plus. I'm not sure if this was a pound fifty or two pounds. Um, at first, the lady wanted to sell everything together. And I just said to her, please, I just need one remote. And um, she had another one there and it had really bad corrosion. So like, I opened this one up and this one's like perfect, perfect. No corrosion whatsoever, works as well. Had batteries in there already, I took them out, put, replaced them, tested it, works fine. And uh, yeah, so that's a really good find, that one. And then we've got um, an Xbox 360 pad. I'm not sure if this is black chrome or just normal black. Um, let me know in the comments if you know which one's which, because I'm not sure. Um, 
and like because if the black chrome one is worth more than just like the regular black one but again this works put the batteries in absolutely works fine so yeah really happy with that so all in all um that only cost me 12 pounds or 12 pounds 50. like it was really like, like i can't believe how little i actually spent today and like how much profit i'm gonna make like i'll put below how much roughly profit i'll make on ebay and computer exchange and yeah i thought it was really good and we're only halfway through because this is uh, August Bank holiday, so um, there should be some more boot fairs on tomorrow. I'm probably gonna go end up going back to Hayes. We'll see how it goes, and uh, yeah, hopefully we get some more great pickups that we did today. So yeah, um, thanks for watching. If you like that, drop a like and subscribe below, and I'll see you in the next one.